Hi, pals. Coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat, the team uncovers a DEA agent doing all the wrong things for the right reasons in the episode Knock Knock Who's There. On this week in Vice, we'll be covering when this episode of Miami Vice aired from March 23rd to March 29th, 1987, when Miami Vice was king. In news, I've talked a lot about wrestling here on This Week in Vice, and the 80s is full of amazing events. On March 29th, WrestleMania 3 took place at the Pontiac Silverdome and is easily the biggest moment in professional wrestling history. This event held matches with such huge names as King Kong Bundy, Bobby the Brain Heenan, the Junkyard Dog, Rowdy Roddy Piper, the Hart Foundation, the British Bulldogs, and Macho Man Randy Savage, and more. But they're not the biggest match of the night. In the main event, Hulk Hogan would rise up with all his Hulkamaniacs and body slam the 525-pound legend Andre the Giant to retain the championship. It was this night that turned me and millions of 80s kids into instant wrestling fans and is still one of my favorite childhood memories. Look at this. He's it. I don't believe it. In music, replacing Huey Lewis in the news on the Hot 100 is the R&B song Lean On Me by Club Nouveau. From the album Life, Love and Pain, the song is a cover of the 1972 classic by the same name by the amazing Bill Withers. The song would spend two weeks at the top, and Bill Withers would win a Grammy as the writer for Best R&B Song. In movies, we're transitioning from Lethal Weapon in its final week at the top of the box office as it finally gives way to the romantic comedy Blind Date. Starring Kim Basinger and Bruce Willis in his first leading role, it performed well in the box office and it had a fairly deep cast including Phil Hartman and John Larroquette. And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to join us on Go With The Heat at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show, go with the heat at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter at go with the heat. That's going to do it for this week. Bye, pals.